Following a few rounds of sun salutations, most teachers will then lead you through a series of standing postures. No matter what the posture is, there's basic alignment principles that you want to think about when you go through each pose. You always build a pose from the foundations. No matter if you're standing on your feet, your hands, or sitting down, you want to make sure that you're building the foundation of the pose from the ground up. So some basic principles to think about are pressing all four corners of the feet down into the mat, activating there, then pulling that energy up by lifting the kneecaps and activating the thighs. You want to also roll the inner thighs back toward the wall behind you so that you open up the sit bones and keep space in the low back. The tailbone drops down toward the floor into a neutral position as you pull the navel in and up, creating a nice long spine and lengthen both sides of the waist. You want to bring the shoulder blades down the back toward the tailbone to keep the front body open and then ultimately reaching up through the crown of the head. Each pose is built on this alignment foundation because you want to stack the joints on top of one another. For example, you don't want to bring the knee further than the ankle because that will put too much stress on the knee joint. You don't want to hunch your shoulders forward like we do at the desk all day long because you want to have a nice broad open front body so that you open up the chest and create more space so that you can breathe and the lungs have more space in the rib cage. There's many different reasons why you want to follow that alignment and you want to think about it in each pose you practice.